Hi. Welcome everybody. Real quick video. Really important. Most of you know what you need and and how to take care of kittens, but you'll need a litter box. You'll need two bowls or one, you know, for food and for water. Then you'll need a basket like this. So when you take your kid in, you know, a lot of people, if you don't have a lot of money, you still want to get the basic shots. Okay, you can get stuff like this. Check this out. You can get stuff like this. This is like $5, right? Uh, Dewarm your kitten. If you're broke, you still want to get the basic shots because uh, cats can carry diseases, okay? Especially outdoor cats, mutts, quote unquote, if you want to call them that. Uh, so you always, always want to get those basic shots. So you want to keep your cat on one type of food, either something like this, kitten food, or canned food but don't introduce don't give them lots of different treats or different foods or you know some people give them chicken and stuff off the table under the table keep that stuff away from them because they will have diarrhea diarrhea is normal for kittens okay it's normal okay a brand new kitten here as you can see he loves his area we usually keep him here and we're gone He's used to it. You want to get your cat conditioned. You don't want to lock him up in a hole someplace, okay? And, and in a cage. Because they don't like to be locked up anywhere, all right? But you want to get him conditioned to an area like this and slowly let him out. Slowly let him out and kind of let him explore. And they're going to do things. They're going to bite things. So it, it's okay. No, don't panic, okay? As they age, they calm down a little, they start sleeping more. But So if you're getting a kitten, you'll need a litter box. You'll need two trays like this or one for food, water. You'll need a basket like this for, you know, waste. And it's nice because you can close it. It's airtight. It don't stink, right? The, oh, hey, what? You'll need litter for kittens. Most of you know they take care of themselves. Sometimes they get dirty, so you'll need napkins like this. Clean them up a little bit back there. All right, don't be don't be don't be afraid to clean them up. Don't be afraid to use napkins. All right. Hi, kitten. Hi. Hi. You kid. Oh, look at you. You got some eye boogers. Hi, big guy. Hi. Oh, you're a good boy. So you want to get your kitten the basic shots. Okay. If you take your kitten in to PetSmart or something like that, right? The initial fee is fifty dollars. So you still you gotta spend fifty dollars. If you don't have that, if you're really broke and you got a kitten, you still want to take and find a place, call around, and say, "Look, I need just the basic shots for my kitten." You can get them at, for like $60, $50, $60 for basic shots, all right, for your kid. You want to do that just to protect yourself and your family, okay, and your kid. You want to keep them healthy. If you don't have a lot of money and you don't have a lot of money to spend, realize this, that it's normal for kittens. It's normal for small kittens to have diarrhea. Basically, you want to first thing you want to do if you get a little kitten is you want to take him in. Now, this guy's the first exam cost me $81. He's been expected, tested by um, looked at by a doctor. Okay, and then he's got some shots here, as you can see, some of them. Um, you ask any doctor, they'll tell you that it's normal to have diarrhea. Now, blood issues, you might have a parasite if you're seeing a lot of. Uh, vomiting, you're seeing uh, diarrhea, you're seeing blood, you want to take him in because it could be a parasite. You want to get that taken care of. It's simple to do, but you still have to go through the exam. The first thing you want to do is get your kitten some kitten food, baby food. Don't get him the real healthy vegan type food for, for grown cats. Get him some kitten stuff, okay? Get him, get him something like this. And this worked. It worked with my kitten. It can work with yours. But realize this, that it's normal for kittens, little, tiny, eight, nine, ten week kittens to have diarrhea, especially if you change their diet, if you just got them, okay? 
What I want to say is, having said that, I want to say that you do not want to get him. Don't get scammed, okay? Because a lot of, a lot of pet hospitals and stuff, they make money off people not knowing what's going on, taking advantage of people. I just want to be honest here, straight up. And some of you know what I'm talking about. But the first time I walked in with my kitten, they didn't even look at my kitten. They brought me a bill for a thousand dollars. Okay, an estimate for $1,000. I'm like, excuse me, uh, on the phone you said $16? Well, yeah, but, you know, so don't get scammed. They'll, they'll try to sell you uh, leukemia shots and, you know, stuff like that. They, they'll, they'll want your kitty's feces sent to some hospital in the middle of nowhere for $90. It literally could get real expensive real fast nowadays. I mean, they treat these cats, these animals like humans. So one thing you want to look out for is uh, to see if your kitten is active. Is he moving around? Is he running around? Is he biting? Is he playful? He's okay. He's fine. So don't really freak out about it. Uh, if you get your cat, if you got your kitten on, on Craigslist or something like that, you want to you wanna get him a product like this. You want to give him a nice bath. Okay, be careful. Don't overdo it. Don't just drop him in there and stuff. And be gentle with kittens. Okay, they're babies. If your kitten's 12 and up, 12 and up weeks old, you want to use a product like this, works well. Okay, get them nice and clean. Also, get them snipped. No, I'm kidding. Okay, trim his paws. Okay, gently. Snip, snip. You want to get them trimmed, uh, especially if you have kids and, uh, and stuff like that. But be gentle with them, okay? Because they don't know what's going on. And you know how kittens are. If you don't never had a kitten, you know they get into things. They, they like playing. They like biting and scratching. So the first thing you want to do, like I said, is, is get his uh, paws trimmed using a knife. Something like this if you know what you know how to do it be very gentle You want to give him a nice bath like I said and the second thing you want to find him a place to his own place Okay a place where he can chill and get him some nice food get him water and take care of him Please treat your kitten nicely love your kitten hold your kitten cuddle with your kitten tickle your kitten Give them a bath once in a while, but don't overdo it. They're clean. They know how to clean themselves, lick themselves, okay? Um, so, yeah, have fun. They're beautiful creatures. They are beautifully, uh, especially these, uh, you know, they're cats, felines. They're fast, smart, not like dogs. You know, dogs, you got you to gotta take them outside and stuff and clean up, uh, pick up their poop. Kittens, you don't got to do that, you know? They know how to take care of themselves. They know how to wash themselves, lick themselves, clean themselves, and be friendly. They're actually good for you. Anyhow, peace out. Take care. So give this video a thumbs up and uh, subscribe if you're cool. If you're not cool, you don't want to subscribe, don't subscribe because this is just a random channel. Peace out. God bless you. Take care of yourself.